Hey all, welcome to Celtic Countryside, the ninth location of the Dhakada quest line. Starting with the speed portion. So in the previous location we saw Dhakada disappeared somewhere. We have to find him now. Okay, there he is. The servitor had guessed correctly that he would be at the pub at the Celtic countryside. Let's go talk to him to find out more. Mm. Let's check out this house on the way. This is a really big one, 1659 tiles, that's like the most, maybe not the most, but yeah, a really big number, definitely one of the largest locations. Mm, also got a chest there. We have couple of these houses it seems, but they don't seem to have anything much interesting. So oh, that was a big journey to reach Tagada, but it's just the beginning. Mm. Looks like Tagada lost the sphere. Now we have to find it somehow. Let's talk to other people here. Okay, dry the floor and repair the tire tables because Sagara caused that damage. We have to find the plate uh, I mean sphere anyway. So let's go ahead and clean up all of that. To fix the table we need some hammer it seems. And yeah, we might find one down there. Okay, this might be to remove that water in the center. Once we remove that, we will be able to access the sponge. And then we can use the sponge to clean up the water on the floor. Uh, we also had a hammer there which I now noticed. But that's okay, we can go and pick it up later. Okay, dragging the sponge to some more spots of water. I think we are done with the sponge part. Now we have to get the hammer and repair all those tables. Five of them. Great, so the pub now looks clean, speak and span, which means we are done with one of the objectives. We still don't have any idea where the sphere is. So let's continue, it might be somewhere in the forest of Celtic countryside. It looks like we have to dig pretty much all the way. 
see a lot of tiles to go Okay, next part of the village. Here's Sagada and someone else. Eleven chicken are lost because of Sagada. And Sagada was busy celebrating. So it's us who have to find those chicken. Okay, here's the first hen. Second one, still a long way to go then. Three. Four. Five. I wonder if there are more in the cave, but let's go have a look. Yes, there definitely are. Okay, it's past midnight, hence the reward. Mm, I kind of forgot the count. Let's go have a look. We have six hen. And we need to bring 11 of them. That's a black opal, nice. Okay, 
eat. Hmm, that's a dead end. I would have expected a staircase there. But looks like we have to walk all the way back. So, uh, not a problem. Let's go gradually. Um, we have definitely completed more than one third of the location with 627 tiles. So, we have dug up a significant portion while finding all those ends. There are still more of them. Okay, Dicky doesn't have to walk all the way from that side. He has a better way to get to the three tiles from there. And a few more missed up here. Okay, so some more hints would be here. Hmm, we have another cave. I would I was not expecting a cave, but well that's okay. Let's see, we have one, two and just two. Do we need just two? No, we need kind of three, but I only noticed two. Maybe either I missed one. That's right, I did not count that one here. So yes, all the three we need are in this cave. Going to the right first. I could have easily got it from this side, but I anyway had to dig up those tiles. Um, let's see, by the end of this, we'll definitely be halfway through. As expected, we are almost halfway there. So, what exactly do I have to put here? Maybe the count of objects or the solution might be somewhere around, maybe. But to me, it does look like we are counting some objects. Okay, so many can't get theirs. Because I missed this one tile. Hmm. This is even deeper.
I'm probably going to have a hard time counting all those objects. But we'll have to. For now, let's focus on clearing. Okay, so it's time for some counting. I'm going to start with the drums. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Five drums, unless there are more here, which I missed. Okay, five drums it is. Four here, one here. Okay, no, I think counted wrong. Four of them are right here and two more. So there are actually six drums. Let's remove the other numbers to avoid confusion. Uh, going for the books next, we have one up there, second in the center, three here, hmm, so three books it seems, um, putting the numbers makes putting the other numbers a bit more difficult. It's better if I take all the numbers in the inside. So three books. Six drums. Let's look at the vases. Uh, one here. Second, third, and fourth. So four vases. I uh, should have probably chosen the object based on its placement here because now it turns out we may have to move a bit of things put the other numbers in place let's count the wheel wheel cart what do you call it hmm they are quite rare in fact i don't even remember seeing one but there is definitely at least one okay we have two so two for that Mm, we can do nothing except pulling these numbers out and then I hope I did not count something wrong okay uh, this one mop and bucket that is just one I think I don't is it somewhere down here I think that's the only one because I haven't seen any more of it and the last one is going to be 5 in that case. I will still have to place the 5 first and now only you can place the 6. 
well 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 looks like a counting mistake let's actually count those black things one two three three it is I don't believe it. I mean, if that is three, then what is the number of books? Books also, I thought, are three only. Let's have a look. One book, two book. Three book. Three is the books. No, did I count wrong? Let's count those black things again. Chain and the wall. Um, two of them are right here. The third one is here. Okay. I think I missed something here. So... Um, still, I don't know. So, I actually counted the vases again. Looks like we have five vases. Uh, let's maybe go ahead and put it. We'll see what happens later. Okay, that turns out to be the correct one already. So, one bucket, four of those balls, six drums, five vases, three books, and two wheelchairs. Okay, maybe that took some time. We finally have the part of cold and sickle. Mm, we have had its parts in the past. Not sure which number was this. Anyway, uh, with that done. It's time to return to Dhagada because we've already found the 11 chickens he required. Then maybe we have yet another task with the last remaining 600 or so tiles. Still a huge number, a big location. Not sure how long the video is going to be. Definitely 30 plus minutes though. it for this area but we still have another area up there okay what do you want now another god child I started with more than 2 million and the total requirement is around 2.45 million going by the requirement I mean going by the reward
this shelter cave whatever would have our last task and it looks like some stone movement tasks let's see if we can talk to the person hi there doors are locked because of you dagda hmm okay have to tidy up the stones hmm i wonder why we are going there i mean it doesn't look like we have anything in those rooms Okay, maybe we do have something. We do not have enough stones, it seems, and we have to selectively place them according to the hints in the rooms. Okay so let's begin the green on the bottom left place it would be true only for one of these uh green at the bottom left is true only for this case let's see we have some more greens at the top i mean both of the right positions which is these Okay so greens are almost done let's also place the last one in the center then we don't have to look at the greens again Okay let's look at another color red in the center and the top right top right is right there and the center is down here uh, another red on the top left which is here on the top left again now let's look at the white ones top left both left and center center is here one of the gates is already opened uh top left and both left so that's like all the white symbols already covered you don't have to leave out any white symbol hmm another door has opened up mm, we have not placed the blue one the blue one is supposed to be on the bottom left and top left bottom left and wait where is the other blue stone are we missing something here we can't remove that one because it just closes the gate again We need a blue stone for top left. Okay, here it is. Somehow I did not notice it. All right, top left is up here. That's the last one, and all the four gates are open, which means we can go further into the shelter, the cave, whatever you call it. Another god jail as well. 
Morrigan's Museum of Siege Weapons. from seeing this mess take the sphere and scram all right the pickaxe still makes a loud sound maybe Marigan will arrive uh, most likely not because the objective has to be fulfilled somehow and taking the sphere is one of the objectives. What do I have in the rooms? Pipelines to fix, definitely. Usually, I start with the corner ones, but this one did not look too complex to me. I mean, we can place any of the pipe anywhere at any time, not an issue with that. That one is the last pipe that should. Uh, maybe douse the fires around the weapons. Mm, we have four of them it seems. One by one we have to douse all of them to finally take the sphere. Everything must be intact before Morrison comes. Let's go to the other room now. The second out of fourth. Hmm, we need to pull that out. should have taken the horizontal one out first because later that will not be possible okay with that then let's put this one back and the corner first this time because this time it matters if you place the vertical ones first you will not be able to please put this one in place. Okay, the pipeline puzzles are just going to elongate the video a bit further. Should be fine. We have already crossed 1500 tiles. A huge number for sure. Okay, second pipeline is ready, and we can douse fire near the uh, monitor. A slingshot, whatever you call that weapon. Let me know in the comments below if you know the names of all these weapons. One, two, three, four. Um, three of them are pretty similar. The fourth one is a ballista.
key of the third room. This one definitely looks like any more pipelines to fix. So let's begin with the corners as a general policy because well I already told you. we have put whatever we could on the right side here and now the little bit more complex looking left part uh, just looking it's probably not again the corner the farthest corner first so this is the farthest corner here and now we can easily place the other pieces Okay, maybe you should also work on putting this one first before the horizontal because you may need some space to go around. Great. So that completes our third pipeline. After this only one more should be left. Okay, I did not turn off the, I mean turn on the valve. Out of energy. Let's go ahead and turn that valve. And maybe I'll get some energy. Okay, I got 15,000. So pretty unlucky daily reward. Anyway, I will just go ahead and eat a food when I run out of energy I don't think one is enough definitely need one more at least and that should be enough We have already completed all the tiles. I'll leave the doubling. I'm just going to proceed with the puzzle. Uh, the corners first. This one can push it down because for the upper one, we have another horizontal one here. That one goes up here. And now for the more cramped part. Again, the corner first because those are the hardest to place. So hard that I had to move everything out. If this was in place, then that would have been much more troublesome. the last final pipeline just need to turn the volume and then maybe talk to the agada collect that sphere other than that tiles are already done so just to complete the quest mm, morrigan has not yet arrived so we can get the sphere just in time Okay, there comes Morrigan.
I think that the image never loaded or somebody just spoke from nowhere. Anyway, so with the big location done. Thank you for watching. Do subscribe to the channel and like the video if it helped. And see you in the next one. Thank you.